И еще один бой. Бой, который носит звание одного из главных событий сегодняшнего юбилейного турнира М1 Челлендж 85. Прямо сейчас! Ready for the M1 Challenge 85? Да, что хороший веселый парень на самом деле. Ну, есть свои тараканы в голове. Ну, типичный американец, ничего страшного. Как бы я дрался с ним на одном турнире, и вот изначально как-то уже не заладилось, уже там мы разделили бонус между друг другом и вышли у нас непонятки. Victor's a bad man because it's gonna take a bad man. It takes a bad man to match me second for second, round for round, because I'm coming. You thought the first time was nasty. You thought, thought the first time was, was flashy. You thought the first time was devastating. Wait, just wait. Так получилось, что от одного ударника к другому, и я буквально приехал домой, отдохнул неделю, и мне сказали о следующем бою, я сразу согласился, потому что согласился и он. что у него тяжелый удар, ну, взрослый уже, как бы, мужик окрепший, 30 лет ему как-никак уже будет. Поэтому у него хорошая функционалка, хороший там, ударная техника, сильный удар. Вроде неплохой греблинг защищается в партере, как с Михаилом показал, вставал хорошо, защищал шею. Поэтому будет интересно, будет интересно. Нет таких у него пробелов, как бы, в чем-то именно. Like a train comes straight forward right at you, no stopping, no second guessing, no questions. I'm going right at you, and I will finish with Nate that train's hand raised in the air. Nate, это конечное. Выходи. Oh, this is my last stop. Fuck you, Victor. Дамы и господа, представляем вашему вниманию трехраундовый супербой в полулегком весе. В синем углу Рейджа спортсмен представляет Соединенные Штаты Америки. По прозвищу Поезд встречайте Нейт Ландве!
представляет Российскую Федерацию, клуб Кузня, город Краснодар. Встречайте, Виктор Колесник! This Moscow crowd here at Olympic Stadium fully behind the Russian Viktor Kolesnik. Unbeaten in his last eight fights. Seven wins, one draw, three first round finishes over that span. Overall in his pro MMA career, Kolesnik 11 wins, two losses, one draw. Kolesnik a very patient, very tactical fighter. Prides himself as such. Also prides himself on the ability to adapt to any difficult situation in a fight. Lesnick told me he wants to throw lots of kicks, high pace but controlled with very good striking defense. He fully expects a very fast, powerful start for Landwehr. Get through that and then slowly take control of this fight. Nothing is, of course, guaranteed in MMA, but in all likelihood, this is going to be a really fun fight. go back to the machine. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, this is an M1 challenge bout in the featherweight division. Now introducing your fighter in the blue corner. This fighter is 29 years old. He weighed in at 65.7 kilograms. He stands 175 centimeters tall and has a record of nine wins with two losses. He is 3FC champion from the United States of America. Please welcome Nate the Train Landwehr. And now welcome his opponent in the red corner. This fighter is 21 years old. He weighed in at 65.6 kilograms. He stands 177 centimeters tall and has a record of 11 wins, two losses with one draw. He is three-time National Universe Fight Champion, World Universal Fight Champion, National Hand-to-Hand -hand Combat Champion, and Southern Russia MMA Champion from Kuznia Team Krasnodar, Viktor Kolesnik! And your referee is about Ugash Pusatsky. Okay, Nate, Viktor. Okay, fighters, no drills. Listen to my commands all the time. When I see stop, he stops. As goes, go back to corners. Our co-main event of the evening, set for the featherweight division: Nate Landwehr versus Victor Kolesnik. Round number one: black trunks for both fighters, blue glove tape for the American Landwehr, red glove tape for the Russian Kolesnik. Well, Nate the Train is definitely a character. He promises us a knockout tonight, John. But he has to be very careful of Kolesnik because he's got knockout power of his own. Outside kick lands flush from Kolesnik. Good left hand on the right. Or goes high with a kick. Rear team kick from Kolesnik. Hands high for Landwehr, moving forward. Yeah, the train likes to go forward. He likes to finish quick. But like we said, Kolesnik is used to going the distance, so he's not going to rush anything. If he gets a quick finish, so be it, but he will last the three rounds easily. Landwehr initiating this clinch. 
Hands on the bicep. There's the separation. Back to the center of the ring. That's what Jess misses with the uppercut. Lesnick trying to go to the body. Doesn't get that head kick through. Nice right cross there by the train. Oh, he gets caught with a one-two, though. The overhand right was the two. It landed. She Kicks. checked that one. Checked indeed. Just his his jab. Jab. Beautiful, Sean. Landwehr walking down Kolesnik, but it's Kolesnik who's landing on the counter. Hot moment there. Landwehr pointing to his eye, then to his cup, and we fight on. Yeah, you gotta be careful not to rush down Kolesnik. He's so cool, calm, and collected. You rush him down, you could walk onto something big. Lesnick thus far not allowing himself to be sucked into a brawl. 245 remaining oh, round number one. Left hook. That uppercut is working well. Spinning back fist hit the gloves. Oh, left hook. That caught its mark. That on the counter from Landwehr. Landwehr starting the play. You see rolling the shoulders. Lands the right and the left. Again, he catches him. Counter right hand by Landwehr off of the Kolesnik kick. Starting to hit the target now. Getting his timing right. Landwehr showing a lot of patience thus far, Machine. He needs to be careful, though. He's stepping forward into the danger zone with Kolesnik. Again, checks that kick. We're swinging big on the inside, just missed with that left hand. Jab from Kolesnik. Kolesnik thus far keeping this fight at his preferred range. Yeah, no one wants to get into a brawl with Landwehr. The thing is with Landwehr, when he throws punches, he doesn't just throw one or two, he throws a few. We have to be careful with the knee. I thought he was going to knee him on the ground there. Landed the right hand, Kolesnik was off balance, Landwehr pounces. Beautiful work by Kolesnik, They're getting back to his feet. He will want to get a takedown. He's been feeling the power punches of Landwehr. Landwehr now on the outside. 65 seconds remaining. Opening round of this, our co-main event, M1 Challenge 85 in the featherweight division. There's the separation. Oh, oh, oh. Landwehr punches himself and says, come on. And we're continuing to try to bait Kolesnik into a wide-open, brawling-type fight. Yeah, Landwehr's thrown that uppercut a lot. He's just missing the mark every time, but now there's blood coming from the head of Kolesnik. Uppercut from Kolesnik. I don't know if that's blo blood off the head of Landwehr, or whether it's on the eye of Kolesnik. It's very hard to see. There's that much blood spread around. Right hand from Kolesnik. Landwehr walks through it. Yelanwe yeah, needs to calm down a little bit. Make sure his shots are perfectly timed. Because if you throw them, that's what's going to happen. You're going to get tagged on the way in. Oh! Right hand, oh! huge kick kick. Kolesnik pouncing. Five seconds remaining round number one. Landwehr back to his feet. Looking for the jump guard, close guard, wow. guillotine. Saved by the bell. That is the end of a very entertaining round one. Wow. What a head kick, Sean. You cannot put your hands down for a second against the likes of Kolesnik. Download the free M1 Global TV app. You can watch our live broadcast from around Russia and around the world in HD quality anywhere globally. It is the M1 Global TV app. Round number one, Kolesnik moving backwards but landing a lot measured from distance on the counter. Spinning back fist, glancing blow mainly, catching the gloves of Landwehr that drew a big reaction from this pro Kolesnik crowd here in Moscow. Landwehr just missing with the uppercut. You see throws big. 
Landwehr again trying to bait Kolesnik into a brawl. Kolesnik landing the head kick, the flash, knockdown pounce. Landwehr got back to his feet. Kolesnik then going for the jump guard, close guard guillotine, could not hit it. That was the end of a furious sequence in round number one. Well, looking at the head of Landwehr, it's on the top of his crown, so it looks like it must be a head clash or something, which has created that cut earlier in the round. But what Landwehr has to do now is keep his hands up. He dropped them for a split second, but that's all it takes, split second. Round number two, Kolesnik forgot his mouthpiece. Landwehr complaining the referee, Wukash Bosatsky. Mouthpiece in now, round number two. Round where receiving that scalp cut. Left side of his head, round number one. Outside kick oh. from Kolesnik. Landwehr back off of the jab. Yeah, Landwehr very vocal and emotional, and isn't he? Wasn't happy that they had to put the mouth cut back in. He just wants to see action. Oh, he needs to, oh! Right hand, that backs off Landwehr. Kolesnik stepping in. Kind of put your hands down for a second. Landwehr swinging big, moving forward. Kolesnik staying very disciplined, not getting sucked into a firefight. Good oh. knee to the body from Kolesnik. To the groin. The knee landed, the shin went through to the groin. Time called by Wukash Posatsky. Posatsky sends Kolesnik to the neutral corner. You'll see the knee. Oh, no, the knee went into the, the groin. The knee went into the groin. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, no denying that. Come on. Hey, wait, 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 wait here. Come on, stay here. Landwehr has up to five minutes to recover. See the blood flowing knees, freely okay? out of Hold that scalp knees. cut. Wasatsky just telling Kolesnik, just be aware of those knees to the body. Landwehr's a trooper, there's no denying that. Sometimes these emotions may get the better of him, though. He needs to be careful. Now he's complaining of the finger in the eye. Landwehr took less than 30 seconds. He's the spinning back fist as we resume round number two. Landwehr's taking a punch to give a punch. He needs to be very careful. Left hand from Kolesnik. Landwehr machine dictating movement, but it's Kolesnik not even countering now. He's largely first in these sequences. Because Landwehr is trying to throw a knockout with every single shot, it's easier to move away from it because you can see Landwehr tensing up just before he throws them. Nice low kick, though. Don't get me wrong, if Landwehr catches him, it could be night lights out, but because he's so tense, you can see him moving. Blue corner is Landwehr's, red corner is Kolesnik's. Counter right hand from Landwehr. Backed off Victor Kolesnik. The separation of the right hand from Kolesnik. Still Landwehr comes forward off of the jab. To be honest, Sean, Landwehr's only got one gear and that's forward. I don't think he understands what it means to step back. Landwehr again pawing at his left eye. The complaint of Landwehr is Kolesnik extending the fingers on the punch. Which is illegal, of course. Faint on the spinning back fist from Kolesnik. That's what he needs to do, Landwehr. He needs to pop the jab out, needs to open things up, instead of throwing big shots all the time. Side kick, there's the level change. Nice defense. Works the double underhooks, he's got it. Now we can do a body lock takedown if he wants. Decides to leave it. And he's inside of the side as Landwehr. He's gonna work for the tight clinch, gonna work the knees now. See the counter tie plump held by Kolesnik. Turns Landwehr, good turn right back from Nate Landwehr. The separation, Landwehr immediately runs forward, center of the ring. Nice job. Fingers, Victor, fingers. Outside kick. 25 remaining round number two. Again, swinging with those punches. I'd like to see him just set them up a little bit. He 
See that landed on the chin, but not fully flush. Swinging again, both guys. To minute number 10 we go. Deep kick. Left hand from Kolesnik. Still Lamware walks through it. Both guys are taking shots to give shots. You know how dangerous Kolesnik legs are. Oh, big one. running hand. Kolesnik landed flushed and misses with the uppercut. Jump knee. That landed as well. Wow. Twenty seconds remaining, round number two. Well, if this goes to the third, I think Landwehr is going to come out with fireworks. I just think he's that kind of guy. He knows he's down now with his, especially being rocked twice here. Right oh, hand from Landwehr, hand. swinging for the fences. Knee from Landwehr, left hand, right hand, and another. That is the end of round two. Wow, we are headed to the third final round. I think the third is going to be more exciting than the first two, to be honest. Both guys are tired, but one gear land where <laughs> he's just going to come forward. He's going to knock out or be knocked out, I think, Sean. Two weeks from tonight, Friday, November 24th, M1 Challenge 86 from Ingushetia, Russia. You can watch it around the world by downloading the M1 Global TV app. Live and free from round number two. Fingers extended, that was the complaint from Landwehr. Again, fingers must be closed. You can't pitchfork out your fingers legally. Spinning back fist landed flush. Landwehr is taken and indeed walked through some big shots through the opening two rounds of this fight. There was a big right hand from Kolesnik. Furious striking exchanges machine. Landwehr is just bouncing, ready to go. Third and final round. M1 Challenge 85 from Moscow, our co-main event for the weight division. Nate Landwehr versus Viktor Kolesnik. Yeah, Landwehr's going to look for the knockout. He's been looking for the knockout from round one, but I think round three, he, he, he thinks he needs it. Oh, there's a nice right hand over the top. I think that's what he needs to do, in and out, in and out. Cause the damage, get out the way. We're trying to work off of the jab, right hand. Lesnick on the teeth to counter. Oh, he nice big left up. hand. The kick not through, but the left hand landed from Nate Landwehr. The mouse under Kolesnik's right eye is popped oh, and leaking it has blood. The blood. Right hand. I think this is a better land where he's using his distance now. Instead of getting into a firefight right on the doorstep. He's getting in and getting out. Superman punch from Kolesnik did not get through. Rear teep again. He loves that plum, tie plum. Kolesnik just pushes him off. Kolesnik again seeking space, seeking distance. Oh, right yeah. hand! And we're right back to the tie plum. Oh, right hand and the left. Then we're starting to open up. He just needs to be careful not to make a mistake. He hasn't got to over indulge himself. Do what he's doing. The punch will come. Left hand from Kolesnik. Still Landwehr walks forward, cutting off the ring. 325 remaining in this fight. Right hand from Kolesnik. Both guys are tough as hell, Sean. This is a quality fight just as we thought it would be. Do you know what? I think Kolesnik's tiring. Landwehr's coming into his own now. Big deep breath there from Kolesnik. And where the blood on his face is from this scalp cut. He oh, took it round nice one. Kolesnik bleeding badly out of that popped mouse under his right eye that popped here in round three. And we're back to the jab. Landwehr is just like glue. He will not move from his side. He's sticking to him. Wherever Kolesnik moves, he moves. He's not giving him an inch. He from Landwehr. Jump knee, nothing there from Viktor Kolesnik. All forward movement throughout this oh, fight from Nate Landwehr. Big left hand! 
Lesnick pulling this fight back to the center of the ring. Throws the right hand. Landwehr right there. Oh, nice takedown. And we're trying to clear the legs. Lands the right hand. And another. Oh, and another. Into the closed guard now. Two big right hands on entry for Nate Landwehr. Posturing on his right knee. There's the angle pick. We spoke about this in round one. Back to his feet, though. Well done from Kolesnik. Then the oh, left hand and left another. Hands. Kolesnik just looked over to see how much time is remaining on the big video oh. screen. Nice defense there by Landwehr. Kolesnik looking for the single. He's going to take his back. He's going to take his back. No, he's turned over now. He did have one hook in. He could have took the back. Landwehr explodes back to his feet. Wow, what is keeping these guys going? That is a nasty cut under Kolesnik's right eye. Oh, Big nice knee. knee! Kolesnik must be thinking, what do I have to do to slow this guy down? Uppercuts now coming from Landwehr. One retaliated back from Kolesnik. Left hand, the uppercut misses again. Kolesnik pulls this fight back to the center of the ring. Again, he looks at the video screen to see how much time remains. 55 seconds to go in this fight. Right hand. And we landed that flush. Still nice and light on his feet is Landwehr. Nice sprawl. That was a super fast sprawl. Especially when you're tired in the third round. Landwehr still looking for the knockout punch. Again, the level change. Again, well defended from Landwehr. Oh, both guys. Landwehr pulled back for a big right hand, but got tagged first. But that doesn't deter him. Upper He's still cut from Landwehr. Oh, big, big right, right hand. hand. Final seconds now with this fight. Another right hand. Kick to the body. Oh, my word. They are swinging for it, John. Kolesnik with the uppercut, Landwehr with the knee, another knee, a left hand. That is the end of an outstanding and furiously paced fight. Fight of the night for me, Sean. If these guys don't get a fight of the night bonus, I'm going to hand in my resignation. What a fight. Nate Landwehr versus Victor Kolesnik in the featherweight division. Going the distance. All three rounds, all 15 minutes. Both fighters taking and receiving. Landwehr now playing to this Moscow crowd. Nice show of respect and sportsmanship between Landwehr and Kolesnik in the respective corners. Four cards of the three judges assigned by M1 now being tallied. Yeah, baby. Let's do it. Into the ring comes in the machine, Freeman. We'll go to the machine now to end all suspense. After three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecard for a split decision. In favor of your winner, Nate the Train You hear the boos. By way of split decision, Nate Landwehr claims the 10th victory in 12 fights in his pro MMA career. And he's a perfect 2 0 now in M1. Okay, I'm with your winner, Nate Landwehr. Nate. Okay, I'm with your winner, Nate Landwehr. Guys, guys, guys. All right, this is the fight game. Anything can happen. That was definitely, in my eyes, fight of the night. But I honestly believe the right man won. Вы понимаете, это бой здесь всякое может случиться, но на мой взгляд это лучший бой вечера.
Okay, Nate. Nate, it was, and it, that must be one of the toughest fights you have ever had. For me, if you don't get a fight bonus for that, I'm going to hand in my resignation. That, for me, was fight of the night. Нейт, это просто невероятно. Это самый жесткий бой в твоей карьере. И на мой взгляд, если ты не получишь бонус за лучший бой вечера, я здесь больше не буду работать. Меня называют Нейт Трейн не просто так. Я иду прямо на тебя, и я не останавливаюсь. Beautiful attitude towards mixed martial arts. Not many people get you, but I get you. I get you a lot. But what is next for Nate the Train? Что следующее для тебя? Я понимаю, что ты такой экспрессивный персонаж. Что будет дальше? Hey, first let me thank, thank Victor, man. You cannot put on a fight of the night without a bad son of a bitch sitting in front of you, banging with you. The man who tried to take me down a couple times, but for the most part, he was here to battle. I got the victory because I'm a bad man. And I got a little song that I made, and it's called, That's an Ass Whooping. And it goes a little something like that. Yeah. That's an ass whooping. That's an ass whooping. Oh, that's an ass whooping. Oh, your name is Yvonne? That's an ass whooping. Oh, you is the champion. That's an ass whooping. I'm going to come for you. That's an ass whooping. They to train all day. That's an ass whooping. Вы все слышали, ребята? Это Nate the Train. Он благодарит Виктора и всех за этот бой. Спасибо. Hey, if you don't like that fight, you don't like fighting, baby. Если вам не понравился этот бой, вам вообще не нравятся бои, детка. He may be strange, but this guy can fight. Clarksville, stand up, Abby Stipe. We here. Clarksville, stand up, Stipe. We here. I pledge my allegiance to that man right there. I'm with M1 for a long time. Thank you for bringing me on, baby. I will not let you down. I pledge my allegiance to you. Я верю на Мадин. Я хотел бы поблагодарить. Организатора, я бы хотел бы поблагодарить лично Вадима Фискенштейна за это. Я здесь для вас. Спасибо. Extremely hard fought from both men. Nate Landwehr versus Victor Kolesnik at tonight's co-main event, M1 Challenge 85. Landwehr, a very flashy entrance, wanted to turn this into a brawl. Kolesnik wanted to fight from the outside at a very measured pace over the course of three rounds. Mission accomplished in moments for both men. Landwehr landing big, heavy strikes. Kolesnik landing heavy strikes of his own. Closing stages of round one, dropping. Landwehr on the flash knockdown with that head kick. Landwehr walking through some powerful punches, powerful kicks, powerful knees from Kolesnik. The big right hand there from Kolesnik. Round number three, the mouse, the pocket of blood under Kolesnik's right eye popping. Able to hit that ankle pick Kolesnik as Landwehr was looking for the ground and pound. Continual forward movement and forward pressure even when taking shots from Nate Landwehr. Both men throwing all the way to the end of this fight. Now 10 and two in his pro MMA career and two and 0 in M1. The winner by way of split decision, Nate the Train Landwehr defeats Victor Molesnik.